Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we are doing a video on this here uh, Land Rover Defender, if I'm correct. I would, yeah, Defender. Or what, in this game it's, you know, a little different, but it's, if I'm correct, it's a Land Rover Defender. And we're going to be doing a uh, rock crawler build with this. Uh, real quick, before the video starts, I want to say, uh, real quick, I'm for the Toyota T Tundra, I don't really know what I want to do with it, so... Uh, if you can, down in the comments, drop me something to do with that, because uh, I, need, I need some kind of idea, because I really don't know what I should do with it. If I want to do a trophy truck style build, or a pre-runner, or if I want to do a rock crawler. So, uh, yeah. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. And, uh, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy. So, we're going to do Solid Axle Pro. All the way around. Ain't going to do heavy duty on this. Not until maybe later on. But, uh. I'm going to do my typical tuning that I do, and I'm going to keep it kind of stock. Or not stock, but, you know, realistic standards with this one. Sniffness on sniffness. Stiffness on the front section of your where I want it. Yeah, I can't talk, so don't worry about it. That was 54. That was 54. So let's go to 3. One, two, three. Should we do the top of 3? Let's do the top of 3. Dampening right about there actually is usually where I said it around 2000. Rear steering, I'm not going to put on this. Not yet. Shock, shock size, I'm not. Oh, let's do shock size, I guess. Yeah, I mean, this, this is. I mean, you can follow my tune, but don't be like. <laughs> don't expect it to be overly. Not break on excellent. Like good because truthfully I'm not very good at tuning in this game. At least in my opinion I'm not. Um Let's mess with wheel radius after I get some tires and stuff on it. And some customization to the front of it. Oh, I kinda just like that stock front bumper, because I mean it sits pretty well. But we'll go with that one. Cage, do we really want anything cage wise? Just keep the stock one, I like the way it looks. Oh no. Let's do cutout fenders with it. Drawing board, put the rock sliders on it. Those roof lights work well with that. Do snorkel. That style horns, I don't really want. Put a spare tire in. I don't know if I'm going to put a spare tire in because that thing is tiny. Why is it so tiny? Exhaust, I'm not going to do. No. I'm going to have to do some research on these, but aren't some of these diesel? I'll have to look that up here after I get done customizing. Because if I'm correct, some of these came as a diesel option too, if I'm correct. Which I could be completely wrong, so. Don't mind me if I'm completely wrong. Um, repair pack. Down the back. Yes, tow mirrors on this. That look just fantastic. Okay, do the good old rock crawler tires on it. They're the best ones, at least, when I know. I'll do those rims. I don't know why, but I always use them. They just kind of look the best all around. We'll do bead locks, the big bead locks on them. And now we can mess with tire size. Now, I'm going to keep the truck the same color because it kind of... Actually, doesn't look that bad the way it sits. Let's just do stock wheel radius all the way up, I guess. And we'll bring that axle width. Four, five, six. So let's just run it up to two. Two. And then what we could do... 
is go to flex. May it clips through the fender a little bit, but I'm not really worried about that. Because I'm not going full on realistic with something that seems like it actually be slightly realistic. Uh, tuning. Slap the, the, that on it. Mm -hmm. Perfect tune. And give me a minute. I'm going to do some research real quick because I don't know a lot about these, but I didn't know what it was. But I'm going to do some research and see if this is a diesel option or if. I mean, even if it doesn't, I might slap a diesel on it just for more power. But give me a minute. Okay, so yeah, I, I am correct. It does come with a diesel option. But real quick, I want to go on wheels and tires, make the rooms bigger. Because with bead locks, it just looks weird when they're not a little bigger. But uh, yeah, it do, they did make a diesel, so turbo diesel. It's a 2 something, 2.5 or something like that. So That's all I wanted to really see was to see if I had it close or not. So and, uh, Let's bring this thing up just a little bit more. Bring it up to 60. Give it a little bit more height. Three, three clicks on. Two, three, four, five. Because I know the rear is usually a little bit less wide as the front. So. Looks pretty good, actually. There should be, I wish there was a uh, rear bumper uh, option. Yeah, that should make that a little bit more tuck under the fender-ish. So, uh, yeah. Actually, I like the flex in this game. I love this game, but like for a while there, I just I played it way too much, and it just ended up getting kind of out of date. My dog just pushed my door open and is now staring at me. What do you want, dog? Give me a second. Okay, now they got a dog panning next to me, so hopefully you can't hear that in the video. If you do, I am sorry, but uh, we're gonna go text, test this test, test this out. So just give me a minute, and I will uh, be back with you guys. Okay, so we're here. I uh, decided to hop on uh, Lee's Creek here and see what we could uh, accomplish on this map. But, I mean, overall, I haven't driven it yet, and I just spawned in. It seems like it actually won't be that bad for rock crawling. It's kind, of, it's kind of like the Jeep, but truthfully, I like Land Rovers in real life. They're one heck of a dependable, dependable, dependable vehicle. So let's just take it over some small stuff. Let's see what we can do in real drive. Without, you know, smacking the bumper off the rock and completely failing. Let's go down to the right here. Okay. I haven't played this map in a while. I wonder if I could get a boat out on this map. I doubt it, but there will be. I don't know. My next video might be going out. And, uh, it'll be some expensive stuff, but going and getting all the other boats and uh, just doing some comparisons between boats. I haven't even touched any of the rocket boats yet, so. You know, but yeah, actually, this thing. Let's give it a little bit of a test here. Let's see how. Oh, it's a lot like the Jeep, actually. Except it's not as a. Uh... Yeah, top heavy as the Jeep seems to be, the two door. Not the Cherokee, but the uh, Wrangler, if I would be correct. Ooh, almost messed that up. And I do like uh, to add, real quick, the new particles they've added to uh, when you're spinning your tires and stuff. There's new particles and everything. Darn, I should have put uh, exhaust on this. I didn't think about it. Your cringe. Nice. That's just great. <laughs> Making a video and I just get your cringe. Bruh. Oh, this is going to suck because like, they've been talking on Discord channel 
not my but private one with me and my friends all day. And <laughs> finally, after I, I did it snooze for like two hours or whatever, and of course, middle of my recording, it decides to uh, take that off. So, you know, just YouTube things. Yikes. Okay. Notice there was a giant hole there. Into the hole. I'm stuck. I do like the new winch system too, because they uh, updated that towards. First, you can actually winch to rocks now. Instead of only dirt. Which I think is just awesome. If I knew how to drive, I'd be doing even better, but we don't talk about that. Yeah, this thing's actually, just for being stock, it's a pretty uh, reliable vehicle from just the little bit I've done. I haven't done anything like really major with it, but I'll make videos, like full-on videos of actually rock crawling it. Just like the Ford uh, Raptor, or Raptor, wherever that thing is. Uh, the Ranger, that's my brain's about half of it right now, so I'm working on that Yeah, I'll have to do a full on video about that. Rock crawling, because I did a rock crawler build with that. I'll do a full on video with this about rock crawling, so uh, yeah. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video, and uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe, uh, like the video, and uh, if you like the video, like the video. If you don't like it, whatever, go away. Um, I'm joking. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and uh, if this tune helps you, uh, go for it. Take it. I don't care. Bye.